Hello, I welcome you all to this another interesting screencast. We are going to be solving this engineering mechanics a problem and it reads a particle travels along a straight line with a speed of uh, uh, v is equal to 0 0.5 t cubed minus uh, a t where t is uh, in seconds. Determine the acceleration of the particle when t is equal to 2 seconds. Right. So we have t here given which is a function of uh, time and we are being asked to find the acceleration when t is equal to 2 seconds. We know that instantaneous acceleration is equal to dv over dt. Okay, so this is going to be equal to dv. What is our dv? It is 0. Point, uh, 0. Point what? 0. Point 0.5. Oh, let me just calculate without rewriting it. So if we are to find the first derivative of this, this is going to be equal to uh, 1.5 t squared minus 8, right? That's correct, right? Yes, 3 that side by 0.5 3 minus 2 there and so on. Okay, therefore our t of 2 seconds is going to be equal to 1.5 2 to the power 2 minus 8. What does this give us? 0.5 by 2 by 2 squared minus 8. So it gives us a minus 2. Right? Minus 2. So we want to determine the acceleration of particle when t is equal to 2 seconds. So this is this acceleration, 2 meters per second squared. So if we are to draw this, we are saying the acceleration of this particle is somewhere there, that's negative. Alright. Or if we are to draw it on the so it is at this point here okay negative so my acceleration is equal to my acceleration is going to be equal to minus two meters per seconds or so this acceleration is uh, also called, this negative acceleration is also called deceleration. So it means the particle is decelerating, right? Or it's like accelerating in the negative direction. Or 2 meters per second squared in this direction. All right. I think that is about all. Thank you for listening. Bye-bye and see you in my next uh, screencast.